Right now we're looking at the cotton top tamarinds. One of my favorite things about them is their hairstyle and that's why they were named cotton top tamarinds. So they've got these beautiful puffs of white hair that come across the crest of their head and all over. It's real wild and crazy and each one has their own distinct hair pattern. So um, while you might look at them and think that they all look the same, they actually have very different poofy, poofy styles of hairdos. They all get along really well, and they're very snuggly at night, so they all get together and slumber together at night. They can be found being curled up in a nice comfy ball. Unfortunately, cotton top tamarins, they're one of the most endangered primates in the entire world. They live in trees, and trees are their home. When the trees get cut down, they don't have anywhere to live. And it's really hard for these guys because cotton top tamarins are only found in one place in the entire world. They're only found in Colombia, in South America, in a very particular part. So when all of the trees are gone, we, we lose all of our cotton top tamarins. The biggest thing that we can do to help cotton top tamarins is we can reduce, reuse, recycle. So that's making sure that we're reducing our waste. We're recycling any materials that we can, so that can be any paper that we use, all of our building materials. For example, their house here at Wellington Zoo was mostly made with recycled materials that we actually have here at the zoo. So what we're doing is we're making sure that we're not taking away from any of their habitat and the cotton top tamarins get to keep their homes. We let them keep what they have and we reuse what we've got.